Wednesday, June 7th, 2023. I fed all the street cats like I do usually at 3 a.m. Unfortunately, I did not see the little orange kitten. It's possible that I missed him or a bigger cat chased him to a hiding spot. The little fellow who I named Joey is still a kitten, but had bite marks all over him and a nasty scab on one of his ears the last time I saw him. Yesterday, I thought it was very cute how the parking lot crew came to the little kitten Joey's defense when Skippy attacked him unprovoked. I saw Skippy the same time I saw Kendra today. Skippy came running down the street. She said Skippy actually follows her to all the major feeding spots, picking fights with other cats before sitting with her at the end where he can eat by himself. Talk about a loner. No word on the newborn kittens at the storage unit place either. They were so loud when I saw them, and they were so I was so visible on their storage camera, security cameras. I'm sure that the owners and the workers did something. I was meaning to go back, but something told me not to, and I've been so tired lately the past three mornings. As soon as I'm done with my regular feeding, I come inside and I go back to sleep for a couple hours. One reason is because I'm so tired, but Hawaii has also been going through a massive heat wave and we've had record highs, the hottest June on record. I can't afford to run my air conditioner, so the only time where it's actually cool enough to sleep is in the late evenings or early morning hours. And it's hard to pass up a nap with a good cat. Am I right? I also have been doing my podcast every day for three weeks straight, and that's kind of like a second job to go with my cat feeding operation. I basically have two jobs, neither of which I get paid. I suppose with the cat feeding operation, I'm paid in cat food. Uh, you know, shout out to Leslie and Boom Time Baby for the recent cat food donations. But as far as the podcast, I'm just surprised I've had such few listeners. I built a community on TikTok with my cat feeding videos to a respectable 40,000. And this is after I found myself in a community on YouTube, which I did not want to be a part of and never asked to be a part of. I figured some or more, at least, of the viewers on my cat feeding TikTok page would come over to my podcast page. I mean, it is on the same website. But to be honest, very few people actually came over. And like I said, I've made good podcasts videos and they and I enjoy making them. They sound good. They're well produced. A good analogy is if I had a group of friends representing my cat feeding group on TikTok, forty thousand, and then all of a sudden I took up a new hobby. Let's say, I playing the trumpet, and I played the trumpet every day at a local bar, and my friends were already at the local bar. They were already at the shopping center, and I invited them to come see me play. Most wouldn't even bother to even hear me play, but others might listen to once and be like, oh, yeah, it's, it's good trumpet playing, but, you know, it's not really my thing. Now, if I could understand, I, I, I could understand if I was playing the trumpet like crap and if it, I was like, <laughs> but I'm fucking as far as my podcast goes, blasting out, banging out Louis fucking Armstrong here. I'm like, <laughs> You know, I'm not giving serving crap. And uh, I just wish uh, more people would notice. Thank you for listening. My name is Gregory Brandt, a.k.a. Mr. G. And everybody have a wonderful day. Aloha from me and the street kitties.